Hey everybody, I'm going to be showing you how to find a short on a circuit board today. We have a Nintendo Switch Lite board here. This board came to me because it had a issue not powering up. So, <clears throat> I searched around the M92 chip right here and found some shorts on a couple components around here. Uh, these two here, a couple over here, and this one over here when I removed the M92 chip. A lot of these shorts went away but the short on this component right here stayed. So <clears throat> we're gonna chase this back and figure out what's causing it. First step to do is confirm you have a short. And that confirms we do have a short. So next step, I'm gonna be using a power supply to inject voltage into that component and using a thermal camera to see what heats up. So just get your negative lead hooked up to the negative pathway on the board. Get your positive lead. Work on the shortage component like this. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit so you can take a look at the thermal camera. So you see the board there, and time to inject some voltage. See we have two big hot spots there. One being around these components here, and one over here. The one over here is probably caused by the voltage injection. And then the one in these, over by these components over here looks pretty washed out, so I'm guessing it's coming from the other side of the board. So let's flip it over. And as you can see, I've removed the shielding for the CPU already. Then I'm going to probe around a couple of these components to see if we have any shorts. So that component there is shorted out. That captor there is shorted out. then there's no more shorts down there. So once again, we're just gonna inject some voltage down in this area to see what heats up. Once again, I'm gonna put about one volt of power through this. Let's watch and see what area heats up the most. very clearly we're seeing a lot of heat come from this CPU right here so let me put my macro lens on my thermal camera <clears throat> and we'll make sure it is the CPU itself and not one of these small components around it This macro lens is going to be pretty close to it. So, there, as you can see, the CPU. And let's inject some voltage now. Yeah, it's very clearly the CPU there. reason it's flashing is because it's at a kind of a awkward angle for me to probe it so it's just my lead falling off of the cap there but if I hold it like that you can see it stays hot I'll grab a picture of that to put on there and now we know that we have a shorted CPU on this board. And that's that.